Eden. We have a testimony from Eden this morning, and um, really special. And she told me last night, and I was just blown away. So maybe you step a bit forward, and then people over, over there see you as well. I heard Liz speak in tongues, and she was saying, yes, God, yes. Yes, God, yes. She's a pointer, hey, just straight up. <laughs> so I, I give you a bit of context. Um, last Sunday at uh, Livingstone's Kids Ministry, they apparently had uh, scrolls where they wrote all the different spiritual gifts that, you know, according to the Bible, are available for us to ask for. And they put them in a bowl, and then all the kids were able just to pick one. And Eden picked one as well, and her spiritual gift that she p picked was the interpretation of tongues. So for those of you that are maybe here for the first time, there, there's a spiritual gift called uh, speaking in tongues. Where, and you may have heard it in worship just before. Some people, they just pray and say things that their mind actually don't understand. It's actually the Holy Spirit giving words and moving the tongue. And so, you know, I speak in tongues and Tanya, but I don't understand what I'm saying, but I, it's a prayer language by the Holy Spirit. And there is a gift where some people can interpret and actually understand what is actually being said. And so you picked that gift, it was on the scroll, and then all week uh, the family prayed into it that she would actually get the gift and have the gift. And then when, when did Liz pray in tongues? Was it yesterday? Saturday. Saturday. And Liz is actually here. Maybe put your hand up. So you prayed in time. Was it a band practice? or it was our worship. Oh, your <laughs> worship. And so, and you just overheard her pray in tongues. And, and suddenly you knew what it meant. Uh, can you say it again? What, what did it mean? Yes, God, yes. Yes, God, yes. So it's simple, but it's actually quite meaningful. And uh, Tatiana, when I told my wife at home, she, she asked, you know, when she prayed in tongues, did you suddenly feel like it was no longer this tongue, but it was English, so you could hear it? Or did you hear her speak in tongues, and then you just knew inside of you that's what it meant? I knew inside of me that it, I knew what it meant. Yeah, so you just knew that you knew. How good is that? <laughs> hey, Maeve. Hey, you, you up here as well. Which, which gift did you pick? The tongues one. Oh, she got healing. <laughs> but actually, you're not only limited to one. According to the Bible, we could ask for more. Uh, just wait. <laughs> Are you ready um, to be prayed for right now? Um, I don't know how you feel, but most of us here, I know, we don't have that gift of interpretation of tongues. But put your hand up if you haven't got that gift. Yeah, we can't. Huh, me too. Okay, well, we get your granddaughter to pray for it now. Just, just settle. <laughs> Eden, you know, we, this is fun. It's an adventure, but we're actually serious now as well. Eden, are you happy to pray that everyone here will just receive that gift of interpreting tongues? Just Yes. Yes. So just pray. So, dear Jesus, and then just pray that we get the gift. Dear God, I pray all these people here will get interpretation of tongues, that gift, and they will understand what they're saying in wow. tongues. Amen. Thanks, Eden. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And just, just take a minute just to receive that. Just give, give God time. Just receive it in your spirit. Lord, we are serious about receiving that gift. We do want to have the interpretation of tongues and use it more frequently in our worship services. Lord, I pray you just pour that out right now. You give it to us, Jesus, this morning. And Lord, yeah, we love to pray also, yes, Jesus, yes. Just say yes and amen to what you have for us. In your name, amen. Okay, so we prayed for that. So, um... We should try it out. How, how would you feel it? It's like, uh, I'm just tempted. Um, is, is there someone here right now sitting that you feel like you actually got a message in tongues that is actually to be interpreted? 
you know, some, some is more private prayer language, but sometimes someone actually, God gives someone a message in tongues and then someone interprets. You may have already been sitting here itching like you got one. No pressure. No pressure. Put you on the spot. Is there someone? I mean, Liz, um, um, you got interpreted before, yesterday. How would you feel praying? You, you can say no. I, I know I really put you on the spot. Ah, oh, here we go. Courage. Should I, should I just pray? Yeah, just pray in tongues for a little while. And we all listen and maybe some of us here will actually get an interpretation. Mm. Or maybe it's you again, Eden. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> so I may just open up in prayer. Just, Lord, um, it is an adventure to live with you. Mm. And those gifts, that they are an adventure as well. And Lord, you say they operate by faith. And faith requires a bit of stepping out and courage. We are not in control, but Lord, we desire your gifts because you told us to desire them. And Lord, this morning, we want to hear what you have to tell us through the Spirit. Mm -hmm. And Lord, we want to operate in those gifts. And I, I, I pray that someone will understand and it will be a word from you. In your name we pray. Amen. <clears throat> A tu asha matu apatikas, a tu rena masu fa patashi, nu tu fa sita apatu fa matita, hanu ashi sita ati. Amen. Did, did you know what it meant? No! <laughs> so what did it mean? She said, yes, God, please heal all the people that are sick. Serious? Yes, God, he please heal all the people that are sick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just stunned. Someone else, do you want me to have a go at praying? Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, so you, you got that... The wind, you confirm. I'm. Hey. Did you hear that? No. Um, the literal translation, Bernadette is confirming what she heard. The wind of the spirit of my healing is coming into okay. my people. I, I do something now that I, I may be in trouble for. <laughs> um, and and I, I, I apologize beforehand. But if that's the word we got. I know that someone is in church here this morning because she needs healing. So yeah. she's actually come for that. But she's very shy and she's the first time here. But I, I may call her forward anyway. Is that okay? Hadi, are you? So, I mean, we just had a word that God wants to heal. Are you happy to come? Maybe just come here and we pray for healing. Thanks, Eden. And um, do, you, do you want to say specifically what you want to be healed of? Diabetes. Diabetes. How often do you have to inject yourself? Every time I eat. Every time you eat. Yeah. And how long have you had it? Since I was five. Since, since so you were five. 19 years. And so you've come here this morning because you want to receive prayer for healing. Yeah. So, hey, this is God. Thank you, Lord. Um, maybe Helen, you want to come as well? Just a few, we just lay. Sorry? Oh, Maeve. Maeve picked the spiritual gift of healing. Maeve, you want to come? And Eden, you can lay hands as well. What's your name? Kara. Kara. What's the name again? Kara. 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 Uh, Eden, you want to lay hands on Kara as well? And Maeve. And the whole, whole church, can we just stretch out our hand? And Lord, we heard your aff affirmation again that you are healing God and you're there for healing. There's a healing wind of the Holy Spirit here right now. And Lord, we pray for Carl. We pray for healing right now. In your name, we come against diabetes, that sickness. Lord, we just expel it. We take authority over it. We break its power. 
over Kara in, in her body, Lord. And we release healing for her all over her body. Just release healing for her, Jesus. Speak healing to the body. I pray that that disease will be gone and the injections will, uh, can stop. And Lord, that the insulin will be working, that the pancreas is totally healed, that everything, all the sources where diabetes comes from is just healed right now, Jesus, in your name. Amen. Um, I was praying for you this morning and the Lord said I had to use a specific phrase. I'm going to end on that, okay? So Father, I give you thanks. And Lord, I speak to this sick and infirmed body. And Lord, I command every cell of this body to come into alignment with your creation, perfect in every way. Father, I ask for every blood cell to be perfectly formed, every chemical to be in the correct balance that you created it to be. And Father, so that the name of Jesus can be glorified, I speak healing, healing in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you. Amen. Very good. Um, we continue worship with our offering.